just like the wind, just like the wind, just like the wind, we are free. Sing along with me, we are free. The true story is a sacrifice, endurance, fortitude, resolution, and devotedness to family. The people who make it to our country, to our community, have traveled far. Many have endured circumstances beyond our imagination. For one, I've had access to an education, and to me this implies privilege and responsibility. Say what you will about our need for radical reform in education, most of which I would agree with. This does not change the fact that growing up here meant I experienced the nurturing warmth and guiding wisdom of teachers and mentors who truly embody the best of the qualities and values that make our little corner of this nation a truly unique place with unparalleled potential. This was true in middle and high school and remains true today at the Evergreen State College. Number two, these qualities are not exclusive to our educators. On the contrary, in my experience, an impressive number of our sisters and brothers in this region share in the deep values of humanitarianism, respect for cultural diversity, and committed environmental stewardship. This poem is called One. We do not need ten commandments, no. Just this, one truth. There are no divisions, we are one. One mind, body, soul, life, planet. Just one. So this is my plea, this is my cry. If you do not understand, I cannot tell you why. It is the ground under my feet and my eyes in the sky. I am one. When you see your brothers and sisters and you say, hey, how you doing? Are you good? Remember, we are one, we all need something like the truth in the center of all the spokes and the wheels surrounded in hope and love i honestly see we are one black white brown yellow and red gay straight queer square we are all eating from the same plate and sleeping in one bed <laughs> when you think of each other instead of fear accept each other as one when you see a sick puppy or a wolf pack on the attack why stay back can't you see we are in one condition and behave as one. Look at us and yourselves in the mirror because everything is one. Let me tell you what we are. Immigrants, both documented and undocumented, provide a necessary economic boost to all societies. We don't just increase the supply of labor, we simultaneously increase the demand for it. We use wages, we rent apartments, we eat food, we get haircuts, we buy cell phones, and we generate industries that supply those needs. We increase the size of the economy and the larger the economy.